today's video i'm going to be doing a vlog and i'm going to be bringing you guys along today is sunday so happy sunday um basically it's going to be like a reset day um plus just like a vibe day so right now i'm on my way to target because i need to get some stuff to make some good breakfast um we might go to whole foods we don't know yet and we're trying to decide oh you were talking to me yeah i was talking to you babe <laughs> <laughs> but yeah we might go to whole foods um because um i kind of want a smoothie from there um so i don't know but yeah i'm gonna bring you guys along today um we have been packing up the house so it's gonna be like some of that cleaning up getting center getting ready for the week um also i want to go furniture window shopping so you know you guys know that i move soon um june so i want to go look for some things we're going to go look for some things um for like the living room and just like some little pieces to just get some ideas of really how we want to decorate so i'm just going to bring you guys along so we're on our way to target now so i'm gonna see y'all there We got everything that we needed. Babe is cooking breakfast right now. She just started. Um, I just cleaned up the bedroom and um, I didn't really film that for y'all, but just cleaned that up. So I'm about to clean like the hallway and stuff up. Um, but I'm just really just gonna just sit here and talk to her and entertain her while she's cooking because I'm the life of the party. Um, I was waiting for you to say something right there. Something sweet? Yes. I'll let you know. You are. I'm lonely in here. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm just going to be here. And I'm just going to let y'all be here with us and enjoy the vibes. I ain't got to worry about that. If they just come out and they on some chill stuff, then I'm valid. Because I don't really want to whip nobody's kids, including my own. Yeah, I wouldn't really want to whip my kids. Um, I will, though. Go get that belt. Yeah, I'm not saying it's out the question, but I wouldn't want it to be like, such a huge thing like i just really want you to respect me i want us to have an open relationship where you could talk to me you could come to me you could be real with me like you don't have to lie to me um even though you're gonna do it anyways because that's what kids do like ain't nobody just gonna be telling their mama everything but just this like just different where it's like i don't know like it's hard raising a kid because they come with so much they come with their own mind they come with how they want to do things and you're trying to put them into a system yeah of your parenting and luckily parent. we'll have like a parent is hard yeah it's very hard um we'll have two of us and then it's like they do something we can go and have a conversation we're gonna have a meeting like okay Not what, a meeting. what do you think i'm trying to see if i can take myself serious as a parent as a parent i think i could y'all this is so good it's so good for you you should try it it's a target it just tastes like watermelon but it's a nice, refreshing drink. And like I said, it's very good for you. It's not that I don't want you here. Yeah. It's something about the way you said to my eyes. I know that I don't make this clear. I fall for you every time I try to resist you. You can get away. Palm trees, beach views, with an every day. All I want to hear is Okay, y'all, so we are at the mall. Um, it is so nice outside. Oh, why don't you have ready the music? Um, but we just tried to go in. Well, we did go in Potter. What's it called? Pottery Barn. We did go in Pottery Barn, um, but their store is still being renovated. So we really couldn't see much because half of the store is like covered off. So we're about to go in Crate and Barrel. 
And I already got some pieces and stuff from here that I know I want to get from my bathroom. So I'm excited to see it in person. But yeah, we just out here with the vibes. I should have brought some shades. Thank you. I just took mine off. These ones, man, they hurt my face. They do? Uh-huh. It feels good. It's nice to be out here before it get like super, super hot. Because when it get like 115, we'll be inside. we be inside things because... It be too hot. So she probably do. Right next to you. Yeah. I try not to show how I feel about you. You wish you were. You don't really want to. I just want to get away. Sit right next to you. this couch and it's like so perfect y'all what y'all think we already this is gonna be our second great couch second great couch great is the vibe always but it's like so small but like big yeah like, let me go perfect. see yeah go ahead babe. like me and the kitties just in this corner and you can be right here too and like yeah. have your space like if we wanted to be in it or you could be down there like this is nice i like I, this i think it's perfect yeah I really, really. How much was that? Yeah. Bro. Yeah, it's so nice in here. Like, I'm getting so inspired and I cannot wait to decorate. And then now we even got brought over to Baby Fever. Our baby gonna have a, a minimalistic room. <laughs> you can create your own room. Oh, that is so nice. Dog, I ate a child like yesterday. Literally. Coming soon. I know, little sneaky bug. That'd be our favorite thing to do, y'all. Like, look. <laughs> we love to just look at kids stuff. Yes, we do. The room and stuff like that. This area now this, is getting. I, I love I this. I really want new. I think we should go new. What y'all think? Our walls is gray. So I don't know how new look off of gray. It's like a light gray in our house, though. I thought but it was I feel like, it was good. I wonder okay, can we it, or, But either way though, if you have pillows that's great and you can like that's how these pillows are, you can still make it work. This couch is cute. Let me show y'all. I like I like low couches for whatever reason. This is like so cute. Y'all can't even really see the color of it. I like that it got two things on the end. So you really bowling, bowling. Chilling. Double bowling. And then I'm gonna need that so I can be eating my food. No. And editing. <laughs> oh yes, on the couch. You're this right. Is, this is good vibes right here. This feels yes. good. Yes. Oh, shit. This store is giving me life. I love stuff like this, y'all. Like, it's making me so happy. We were trying to decide if we wanted a dining room table or not, y'all. We so thirsty for a pool table. We was like, we can put a pool table in our living room. <laughs> but we like, that's gonna look tacky. But I don't know if we want a dining room table because we have an island. And I'm like, oh, we could just eat on an island and get bar stools to keep, like, this open space that we got going on in there. So I don't know. Do y'all think we should get a dining room table? Drop in the comments if y'all think we should get a dining room table. Yes. Maybe I can just put the whole table on. You could. Maybe if we get a small one. Yeah, so you don't take up all your space. But yeah. yeah I want a canopy yeah. bed so bad. Kind of. Yeah. You talking about the thing with the little drapes? I'm yeah. Like yeah. <laughs> I want a canopy bed so bad. I always want one. Your body drive me crazy. Your body need a license fit. Your body are too tight and neat. Anybody who got eyes can't see She just wanna dance and tease She just wanna dance and tease me 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 Listen, you've been missing since 2016 Squid tell me one thing
Okay, y'all. So we got our hopefuls. We got our what's it called? Fruits. I like fruits. Vanilla bean, they so good. Go try them. They're super good. And then we got some spring water. That's so good for you. So we about to try it for the first time. You got yours open? Yeah. Ooh, strong. That's I like them strong. That thing will start choking. Okay, let's choose. The bottle is sitting and sitting on me off, but it's super good. It's really good. It feels like clean going down. Yeah, it did. And like not like chemical. I just want to eat the micro. Yeah, these little things are so good. Like, we're in, where are you from, London? I really like this. It is literally like no aftertaste. It's water. That's the thing. Like, if you ever drink with water bottles, like regular water bottles, they got this like aftertaste. This don't have an aftertaste. It's so good. It has, it has like it zero has no aftertaste. aftertaste. I don't like cold water aftertaste anymore. Mm -mm. It was like good for like two seconds. Like, it tastes like you're drinking nothing. But, like, that's what water should taste like. Like nothing. Like nothing. Okay, uh, so right now it is 9.43. And um, I just got done washing my hair and blow drying it. As you can see, which I was dreading doing, but I ended up just doing it and getting it over with. Um, so yeah, now I'm about to do my hair. So I want to do some um, bantu knots because I really want this certain type of curl look that I'm going for. I used to bantu knot my hair back when I like first started high school, um, but I used to do it so wrong. It turned out cute then, but what I'm going for now, I had to do it differently. So what I used to do was like wash my hair and then um, blow. I used to wash my hair, but I would do it on wet hair. So like my hair would be wet and then I would do the bantu knots. And it was cute, but the look that I'm going for it's gonna be cuter with my hair blow dry and then doing the bantu knots. I have this is my first time doing it that way, so I hope it turns out cute. But yeah, so we're just about to get into that because I have been trying to just do some different things with my hair. Um, and I was like, let me go back to my roots a little bit and do some bantu knots. Um, so hopefully they turn out cute. I have a good feeling about them. So, I'm kind of excited. But overall, today has been really fun and eventful. After we, um, we just been chilling, like, after we left Whole Foods. Um, just sitting, chilling, resting, y'all, because we have been doing so much. Like, literally so much. So, yeah. Just been chilling. But yeah, so we had just been chilling. Um, the furniture store, well, going to Crate and Barrel was nice today. Um, it had me really, really excited. Like, I don't think y'all understand how excited I am to, like, move. I think I want to make these bigger. How excited I am to move and, like, to decorate. Like, y'all, I'm so thirsty. Like, it makes no sense. Like... Um, it was nice to really get inspired by that. Um, I can't wait for the content with that. Like, it's just going to be so fun because I have so many ideas um, already. And like I said, I already have, like, a cart full of stuff. Like, I'm just really waiting for us to get there to get everything and do some unboxing videos and show y'all and, like, really bring y'all on that process. But I'm super excited about that. 
um this is gonna be like our first home that we like actually like decorate decorate like really really step it up a notch with the decorating so i'm excited but yeah i'm gonna talk to y'all about my vegetarian journey because it's literally been two months and 10 days two months and 10 days which is so long and i'm so proud of myself honey um it's so funny because my girlfriend literally like yesterday or the other day just reminded me like of how i used to be when i used to eat meat y'all it was literally so bad like i never told y'all like in detail like why i really stopped but basically i had like acid reflex but also like my stomach couldn't digest meat so basically every time i would eat meat like immediately after i would eat meat um whether it was like chicken ground beef uh, any type of meat i would like go to the bathroom and like throw up like literally like immediately after and it just became like so disturbing my arms are so tired um, it just became so disturbing because every time we would eat, it would just be like, dude, I would have to go throw up. Like, and I would just keep trying it because, you know, at first I thought it was just like on my period. Like I couldn't eat meat on my period, but it really started to become like in general. Like I wasn't really able to eat it because every time I would eat it, I would feel like I had to throw up. And like, that's just so... You know, like, other people are eating and it's like, you know, they know you in the bathroom throwing up. Like, it was just, like, a lot. And it just really didn't feel good. Like, you know, it never really felt good really eating meat. Like, I wasn't able to enjoy it because I know, like, I'm about to go to the bathroom and throw this all up. And who really likes throwing up? Like, that is, like, the most painful thing you could really do. <laughs> um, so, you know, I just really couldn't digest it. So, I'm like, you know. Let me just really, like I said, listen to my body and just really start um, taking my health more serious and, like, stop ignoring it. And it's literally been two months and ten days. And, y'all, when I say I do not regret it, like, I have been feeling so much better. I eat, like, peacefully. Like, I don't have to worry about ever really, like, having to throw up or have to run to the bathroom. Um because like no other food really does that to me but me so like i don't have to worry about that i don't have to worry about pretty much like any of the things that i did when i was consuming meat like i can literally enjoy my meal um i don't have to worry about like you know ruining ruining anybody else's meal and their appetite um and then it just feels so much better like i've been having so much more energy um, I've been able to, like, last longer throughout the day. Um, it really be having me like, what? What y'all be doing? What y'all be putting in that meat? But um, I really be just feeling so much better. Like, and I was, I used to feel like, <laughs> I used to feel like, you know, being vegetarian or, like, vegan and stuff like that was just, like, so boring. Like, <laughs> but honestly, you can really do so much with it you know what i'm saying and me it's you really see how much like meat don't play that much of a role um in anything like my vegetarian my vegetarian nachos were so good um and just coming up with like different meals like um i'm gonna try these i'm trying to make these cauliflower wings so it's basically like wings but they're made of cauliflower um and yeah like i'm so excited to try that i might do that in a vlog like make that my little thing because y'all know i did the vegetarian nachos in a vlog if you haven't watched that vlog go check that one out um but yeah so i might do that in a vlog but yeah like i'm excited to make that and it really just be fun coming up with like this different recipes and trying new stuff like that just be having me like want to just keep trying new stuff because i used to be really like a closed off eater like the type of person to be like say like i don't like something before i even try it and now i'm just kind of like more open because you know i kind of have to be like i be at whole foods like just trying to buy everything because i literally be excited and then the food just be so much better because it don't feel like when i used to eat meat i used to just feel like it's just this like 
dirty feeling like not even being funny like it's just this weird feeling but like when you change what you eat like everything just being feels so clean like I just feel so clean and like really refreshed like i don't know after i be eating like better so i'm so proud of myself for that y'all my arms are tired honey okay how you don't like me but try to do everything like me See, that is what gets me. Let's see. After all that surgery, you're so ugly. Okay, y'all, I'm done. And I know I look crazy. Because like I said, they're not for, it's not for the aesthetic. I'm not wearing this as a hairstyle. I'm just doing this to curl my hair. So I don't mind how I look right now because I look real crazy. But I'm finally done. That literally took forever and my hair is tight right now and my arms hurt because it took forever and some of these pieces trying to play with me because they trying to unravel but i'm about to go ahead and put my press ons on um and i guess y'all can stay here with me while i put them on i have not found a nail tape out here yet i have tried somebody and i didn't really like my nails so i don't know and i don't really really like going to the chinese people so i'm still on the hunt um for a bomb 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 nail tech so until then we gonna make it what to do and apply these press ons i got these from target i don't usually get these i usually get the um the french tip ones the short french tip ones but they have been so out and it has been upsetting your home girl but i'm gonna show y'all how to really make press ons cute because like this shape I like I like hate it. Um so I'm gonna make it look a little bit better. Um so I'm gonna show you the before and then show you the after when I actually like go in and put my little filing on it and how it look after that. So baby, you a little 48 baby, got a little candy in a pocket. She gon' take off like a you a little post so baby. You a little 48, baby. You already know, no, no, no. Ready to come on the side. Cause you but I know you probably cross side. No, I gotta come and check out. If we could live in this moment and just hold it. The flowers will be blooming, the leaves will be turned.